My name is Gitanjali Rao and I am the Discovery Education 3M 2017 Top Young Scientist. Today I am touring Denver water. This water here originated as snow melt from the mountains from way up over there. We are having a very special guest today. Good morning. Welcome to Marsh Water Treatment Thank Plant. Thank you. She invented a test to detect lead in drinking water. Anytime you have a student that shows that amount of talent um, from our own service area, uh, we have to celebrate that. My device is called Tetvis and it detects lead in water faster than the current techniques out there today. This is a really viable piece of high-tech equipment. All you have to do is dip the cartridge in the water you want to test and pull out your phone and um, once you click check status it's 10 seconds at the max in order to receive your results. Our scientists are really eager to learn about her science. I mean, these are folks who look at science not only as their job, but it's a passion for them. Do you see this as being viable for other emerging contaminants? Are you looking at other forms of problems in water? We hope to show her some of the instrumentation that we use to test the water that ensures that we are meeting and exceeding the regulations. In 2017, we tested nearly 10,000 samples. We're showing her the Marston treatment plant and our water quality lab. Our goal number one is to provide the highest quality, best tasting drinking water. One of my favorite parts was looking at the filtration systems and how they work. We test everything to make sure that from the watershed to the treatment to the distribution system, yeah, it's good yeah. quality. It's amazing to see that what we take for granted has so much work behind it as well. There is no lead in our water, but we know there are customers who have lead service lines or plumbing that contains lead in their homes. That's why we offer free lead testing for our customers. And that is why we are so interested in any advances in lead detection. It's amazing to see that I was originally inspired by them to create this device and now they are almost inspired by me. There are great new scientists and leaders that are coming behind us and so we can be confident that there will be people who will follow in our footsteps to finish what we're doing and take it to wherever it needs to go next. I really hope that my device or just my pr whole process overall inspires young kids all around not just America but all around the world to look for problems out there today and try to attempt to solve them. I know a lot of people say that kids are the future but I want to spread the message that we're here now and we can make a difference.